a pancake GM detector it doesn't distinguish between alpha, beta or gamma irradiation but shows combined reading. That is of course not true gamma level. Gamma level appears to be only slightly above background. The scintillator is far more sensitive than GM counter. Average background level. Outside towards the detector. Combined reading for alpha, beta, and gamma, but VC for 12 plastic is not very sensitive for gamma irradiation. We use a piece of paper to block the alpha. Now let's try to identify the isotopes present in the sample. This is a homemade gamma spectrometer. This is a homemade multi-channel analyzer. We are showing cesium-137, europium-152, and after zooming in a little, americium-241. Zooming out to the full screen. An alternative approach is uh, using an external external sound card uh, and gamma spectacular uh, connected to a PC with uh, BRA software.
this is uh, PRA version 24. Now we subtract a previously recorded background. This makes it more easy to identify the individual peaks. Europium 152 emits around 100 of different gamma energies, but only a dozen dominate the spectrum visible by the scintillator. smoother spectrum after uh, 6 hours or 7 hours and back to uh, subtractional background this is a logarithmic view which shows the peaks perhaps a little clearer and this is after background subtraction in logarithmic view.